Hello, hello, hello. OMG. Welcome back to my channel. So excited you are here. Thanks so much for clicking on this video. I appreciate you. It's Jody Dunn. I'm outside of the Walgreens getting ready to do my Sunday Walgreens haul. If you're new and you just found me, I am so happy that you are here. Would you please say hello to me and let me know you are new right down there. I would love to welcome you to the channel and say hello back to you. And if you are already subscribed, uh, thank you so much for coming back to another video. I appreciate you and definitely leave me a hello down there so I can say hi to you as well. So we got quite a few good deals happening this week. Um, I received a spend 30 earn back $6 in Walgreens cash digital spend booster. So let me know if you got a digital spend booster and what you received. Um, I'm working on my monthly spend booster. I'm not sure if I'm going to do it, if I'm going to finish it. Um, it's, I guess it's going to depend. I feel like I've been getting a little spoiled with the monthly spend or the multi-use spend boosters that we had been getting previously. Those make it so easy to complete those monthly spend boosters. We don't have any right now. Fingers crossed. Maybe we will get one this week or this month. So anyways, I'm kind of just doing transactions to track towards that monthly spend booster, but not like actively working to get it. Um, so anyways, that's it. We're going to run into the store and grab some deals. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. Let's go grab some awesome deals. Happy Sunday. We are in the Walgreens getting ready to do a couple of awesome deals today. I did want to mention there is a gift card promotion happening. We had one last week as well, which I did not do. And I got a lot of comments last week saying, I'm surprised you didn't do the gift card deal. You guys know me so well. Usually whenever Domino's is on a gift card promotion, I will grab it because we do do we do get Domino's sometimes. So I might as well earn some rewards. Well, I had a very sweet subscriber and friend. Thank you so much, Lillian. Send me some Domino's gift cards. So I just passed on it last week because I already have some, but I should try to remember to tell you guys about the deals even when I'm not going to do them. So we have another one this week, and it is buy two participating gift cards. You can look in the ad, search under, um, filter it under seasonal toys and gifting, and it will tell you the gift cards that are included when you buy two you earn back a free $10 Walgreens gift card. So if any of these gift cards are something that you would normally use, or maybe you want something for Father's Day, this is a great time to get it and snag yourself a free $10 that you can use at Walgreens. All the gift cards are gonna list their minimum required to purchase them. So some of them might be 15, some of them might be 25, some of them might be 50. You'll just have to look at your store. You cannot use Walgreens Cash to pay for gift cards. You cannot use Register Rewards to pay for gift cards. They will not count towards any spend deal. So you're just going to buy gift cards that you would normally be buying anyways and earn back a free $10 Walgreens gift card. Now that $10 Walgreens gift card can be used on spend deals. It's like spending cash. So I'm not going to do it today, but just wanted to mention it in case it's something you are interested in. All right, so we're going to move on. I'm going to do just a quick, easy deal to get this $10 register reward to help me on a spend deal. So the Shea Moisture deodorant is um, on sale for $10 each, and it is buy two, earn back a $10 register reward. Well, check your Fetch accounts because I have some bonuses for these that's going to make it a really great deal. So I'm going to grab two of them for $20. I do have one $3 digital coupon. So I'll pay $17. I'm just going to pay it with Walgreens cash. Uh, I'll earn back a $10 register reward and then I'm going to submit over to Fetch Rewards where I have a spend 20, earn back $3 and I have a $1.50 back with a limit of five for each one of the Shea Moisture deodorants, which is going to make them 50 cents each. Because I want to get a super duper low out of pocket and just use $20 in Walgreens cash and because these are one of our favorites, the Flips White Chocolate. I'm going to grab two of these. They're on sale for $3.49 each. 
and we have a $1 IVC store coupon that you can clip right in the Walgreens app that will take a dollar off when you purchase two. So I'll pay $5.98 for these two. I'll submit to Ibotta for 50 cents back on each one. And then I'll submit to my points for $2.04 back for buying two. You might use Swagbucks, I use my points. So that's gonna make these $1.47 each. And get my total just above $20 so that I'll be able to use $20 in Walgreens cash and just get a super duper low out of pocket. Even though the Shea Moisture deal says it's a spend 20, earn back $10 in a register reward. Whenever you're earning a register reward, you can pay any type of way. So I can absolutely use red I, I can absolutely use Walgreens cash. I can also use register rewards. I'm gonna throw in a two dollar register reward in this transaction. And then I'm gonna use the $10 register reward I get from Shea Moisture on my spend deal that we're gonna do in one second. But we just talked about gift cards. And last week I drew, drew two winners of a $25 Walgreens gift card and one of them did not claim it. I've already mailed out one. Um, so I had bought a $25 Walgreens gift card to give to one of you and that winner did not claim it. So we're just gonna do a new drawing this week for a $25 Walgreens gift card. So all you have to do to enter that is make sure you are a subscriber, give the video a thumbs up, and any comment you leave down below will enter you into that $25 gift card uh, giveaway, and I will draw the winner next Sunday. All right, let's move on to our first spend deal. So we haven't had a free deal of Garnier Fruit Teas at Walgreens in a long time. So super excited. It does include the stylers as well, but they are on sale two for $8 and they're on promotion for buy two, earn back a $4 register reward. Now the ad says you earn back $4 cash, but the tag said $4 register reward. So either, either way, we're gonna earn back $4 and we have a $4 off two digital coupon. So we'll pay four, we'll earn back four, making them totally free. And I'm working with my spend 30, earn back $6 in Walgreens cash digital spend booster. The next deal I'm gonna add to this is the Irish Spring Bar Soap. Oh my gosh, we haven't had a deal on this in forever. Now it also includes the soft soap um, body wash and the Irish Spring body wash, but I'm going for the bar soap. They're on sale for $5.99 each and they are on promotion for buy two, earn back a $2 register reward. So these will be $11.98 and we got a $4 off two digital coupon specifically for the bar soap or you could get the big things of um, hand soap refills, but we haven't had coupons for bar soap in so long. So after digital coupon, I'll pay $7.98, earn back a $2 register reward, makes them about $3 a pack. Like I said, the body wash of Irish Spring and Soft Soap is also included. We have a separate four off two digital. You can do this a couple of times if you want, just do them in separate transactions because only one register reward per deal, per transaction will print. All right, I'm also working with my monthly spend booster of spend 46 times, earn back $25 in Walgreens cash if I decide I wanna finish that. So I'm gonna get my transaction up to 40 and I'm gonna go for the laundry deal. These are on sale for $5.49 each and on promotion for buy four, earn back a $5 register reward. So I'm gonna go ahead and grab two of the liquid tide then i'm going to grab one of the scent beads for five dollars and 49 cents my store only had one <laughs> in stock and then i was also going to grab a downy or a bounce dryer sheet so these four total me 21.96 for the tide i have a one dollar digital coupon and a $2 digital coupon that two dollar is no longer available to clip i got it at the beginning of june so when you scan the product, it is not gonna show that it is attaching because it's no longer available to clip, but it'll still come off if you have it clipped. I also got a $1.75 digital coupon for the scent beads. Not all accounts will have gotten that. And I had to put the bounce back because I thought I had a dollar digital coupon for it. I do on another account, but I did not have it on this account. So I grabbed the Downy Fabric Softener where I have a dollar digital coupon. So I'll pay $16.21 for these four and earn back a $5 register reward. 
So my Irish Spring, the Fructis, and the Laundry totals me $41.94. I had a sweet subscriber send this to me in the mail. It did expire four days ago, but last week I used one that was like six days expired. So I'm gonna try and see if this one works. A spend 40, earn seven paper booster. I'm gonna throw in a $4 and a $3 register reward. And then I'm also gonna throw in the $10 register reward that I receive from doing Shea Moisture in my first transaction. So as I've talked about several times, register rewards do not attach to items. They haven't for about two years. So using three register rewards along with all of my digital coupons, I will actually have more coupons than items, which is totally fine. The only thing that I'm a little nervous about is sometimes on the day the register reward prints, so the $10 is gonna print for me today on the Shea Moisture, sometimes the system will reject those register rewards. I normally don't use register rewards I received that day, but I'm gonna test it and see. If that happens to you, you just earned a register reward and you try to use it and the system rejects it, you just gotta wait a couple of days and then they work just fine. All right, well, I'm gonna switch cards and move to a different Walgreens card and do one more transaction and it's gonna be a spend deal and I'm super excited about it because I'm running low on Nexus. Nexus is spend 20, earn back 10 and these big huge ones are on sale for $16. My store only had one of the big ones of that we like. They had another kind, but I like this one. So I'm gonna grab this one for $16 and then I'm also gonna go ahead and grab a shampoo for $16. I'm grabbing the smaller bottle. They're both on sale for the same dang price. Um, I was gonna grab the one I like, but we're totally out of the one Donna likes. So I'm gonna grab this one for Donna for $16. So that's gonna be $32 for these two. I have one digital coupon for $3 off. I have a Fetch Rewards bonus for spend 30 on Nexus products, earn back $5. I have the digital spend booster on this account as well of spend 30, earn back $6. And then I also have the summer essentials booster of spend 35 in summer essential items, earn back $10 in Walgreens cash. I hadn't used this booster on this account yet, so I still had it available. I'm so happy I saved one. Uh, it is a one-time use only, but it will stay in your clipped coupon folder until it expires, and you can see it expires on 629. So even if you've already used it, you're still gonna see it in your clipped coupon folder. If that confuses you, you can always go in and unclip it if you've already used it. But I'm so happy I still had it because the Nexus is also part of that booster. So we can use it for this booster if you still have it available. It's giving back a register reward. I have a fetch rewards bonus. It's triple dipping plus the regular weekly booster. Uh, but I don't have 35 in products. So I'm going to go ahead and add the Garnier Fructis, which I already went over this promotion. Buy two, earn four on sale two for eight. I'm going to grab the stylers this time. But these are also included in the Summer Essentials um, booster. And I do have the $4 off two digital coupon available on this card as well. We also got free printable coupons for $4 off two. So my Nexus and my Fructis totals me $40. So I'm eating the Summer Essentials Booster, the monthly booster I have, the weekly booster of Spend 30, Earn 6, and I'm going to go ahead and throw in a Paper Spend Booster. Now, the Paper Spend Booster I tried to use in my first transaction that expired four or five days ago, it did not work. It said it was expired. But I do have one that I received last Sunday that expired yesterday. Usually, they will like, scan one day past expiration. So I'm going to try that one. And I'm gonna throw in a couple of register rewards as well. With everything stacking on this promotion, it's gonna be like close to a ding $10 moneymaker. So help me pay for my other two transactions. All right, this is what I'm gonna do at Walgreens today. Let's head to the kitchen table and go over this haul. All right, we are back at the kitchen table with this Walgreens haul. There's Clarkie down there for any of all that like to see Clarkie. Donna Jean. Woo. <laughs> Can we get a louder woo than that? Woo. 
All right, we got a Don and Sheen. <laughs> Clarky was just laying with her on the couch and then he got up. Uh, so anyways, we're going to go over this Walgreens haul. Um, I just have to share this with you really quick. Um, I, I just opened this gift. A subscriber sent me this pillow and I love it. First of all, I love pink, but it also says OMG. She found it at Michael's. Kim, thank you so much for thinking of me. Um, but I'm just going to ask a quick favor from this awesome, awesome community. Um, so Kim had written me a letter. It was dated um, May 6th and just a super duper sweet letter thanking me and, you know, how she saw this pillow and thought of me and she was sending it to me um, as her gratitude for sharing deals and things like that. And then um, she wrote down on the bottom of the note that she had a tragedy happen. I'm not going to share Kim's, um, you know, life details on my public YouTube channel because I don't have permission to do so. Um, and she was, you know, apologizing to me that the the package was late. I just got it um, like a couple of days ago. So, uh, Kim, don't even worry about that. I am so, so sorry. I'm sending you lots of prayers. So if this community would like to send Kim some prayers, um, that would be amazing. I know a lot of you are praying folks and um, I'm sure that she could use a little bit of uplifting. So Kim, thank you so, so much for thinking of me and I'm sending you big, big virtual hugs and prayers your way. All right, let's get into these deals. Um, so first I did the, I told you I was going to do the Shea Moisture and the flips. I wanted to get that $10 register reward. Plus they were both great deals that I just wanted to do. So here it is $20 for the Shea Moisture and then the two flips. And you can see my one off two IVC coupon coming off. I use that $2 register reward and my $3 digital off the Shea Moisture came off. So $20.98 was my subtotal. And I just used $20 in Walgreens cash to pay for it. I did receive my $10 register reward, which you'll see on my receipt in the next transaction. I told you I just wanted to use that on my spend deal. Submitted my receipt to Ibotta for 50 cents back on each one. And then submitted my receipt to my points for $2.04 back for the flip. So I paid $22.98 for that little transaction. Of course, I just paid it with almost all store money. I received back my $10 register reward. Oh, and submitted to Fetch Rewards for $6 back. Now, Fetch Rewards, uh, I should have bought two separate, <laughs> two separate cents because what it did was it gave me back the $1.50 for purchasing each one, but it only counted one $10 for the spend 20 earn back three, I think it was. So I did have to correct my receipt. So, so far I got $3 back, but I'm waiting for the correction to come through. I should get back $6 from Fetch Rewards, um, the $1 from Ibotta and the 204 from MyPoint. So my cost for that little transaction of four products was $3.94. Then I moved on and did my first spend deal where I grabbed the Irish Spring, the Fructis, and the four laundry products. So here is that receipt. Um, my two Irish Spring, there's my four laundry products, and the two Fructis. I tried to use that paper spend booster I told you in the store. It did get rejected. So I don't know if all of them are now getting rejected. My guess is yes. Maybe they fixed that where they're not scanning um, that far past expiration, but I did have one from Sunday. I actually had two from Sunday. A spend 35 earned seven that expired yesterday, and that one did scan just fine. So register rewards, I used a four, a three, and the $10 that I had earned from Shea Moisture, and then all of my digital coupons came off. So my subtotal was $11.19 to pay, and I did pay that using my PayPal debit card. My receipt did not show me what I earned back, but I'll pop it up on the screen. And I earned back $13.41 in Walgreens cash, which was six for my spend 30 earn six, 
and seven for that paper spend booster. And then the Catalina machine spit me out my $5 register reward for the laundry, my $4 for the fructis, and my $2 for the Irish Spring. So that transaction, I ended up paying $28.19 was my, what I paid with my subtotal and my register rewards used. I earned back $13.41 in Walgreens cash and $11 in register rewards. So it cost me $3.78, which I think is a fantastic price. And then I always like to show you, and I always talk about, try to talk about this in every video if I remember, because I have new people that show up and don't understand, but let's count my items. I had two Irish Spring, three, four, five, six, seven items. I used one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight coupons. So again, register rewards do not attach to items. They don't kick off your digitals like they used to like over two years ago. So everything was good. I used them one extra coupon that I had items for. So that was an awesome transaction. And then I went ahead and did the um, summer essentials where I really wanted to grab the Nexus. And so excited that that big, huge bottle was on sale for $16. Uh, so there it is for both of them for $16. And then my two fruit teas for $4. I had a paper spend booster of spend 35, earned seven. I used a $4, a $3 register reward, and I had a $4 and a $3 digital. So $26 was my subtotal that I paid with my PayPal debit card. And again, my receipt did not show me what I earned back. So I'll pop it up on the screen. I earned back $23.40 in Walgreens cash. That was 10 for the summer essentials, six for the spend 30, earned six, and seven for my paper spend booster. And then the Catalina machine printed me out my $4 register reward for the fructis. Look at this coupon I got, $5.50. You will just sometimes get coupons out of the Catalina machine off of one easy up product. Excludes colossal packs. I wonder if it only works on the boxes or if it'll work on the bags. Anyways, that's an awesome coupon. And then I got my $10 register reward for spending 20 on the Nexus. Submitted my receipt to Fetch Rewards and earned back the $5. So for this transaction, I paid 33 and I earned back a total of 4240. So these four hair care products were a $9.40 moneymaker, which is awesome. So I had a $9.40 moneymaker here, a $3.78 cost here, and a $3.94 cost here. So everything on the table ended up costing me, no, it didn't end up costing me anything. Everything on the table here was free plus a $1.68 moneymaker. Super duper happy with that. So happy to get some bar soap, Irish Spring Bar so particularly, haven't got it in forever. My husband likes it, my mom likes it. So I've been out in my stockpile for a while. Um, super happy to get the Nexus, the flips, the laundry, everything. So there you go. And that is my Sunday Walgreens haul. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. I appreciate you so much. And I'm gonna see you again soon. Bye.